Hello, Mother. Well, hi there, sweetie. You know, Mother, life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. Your life, however, is more like a box of active grenades. Now, I offer you one last chance for deliverance. Return my mind control device or be destroyed. Oh, you just want your toy back. Okay, here you go, honey. Yes, well, victory is mine. <laughs> ah, damn you all. Hello. Oh, my God. Lois. Oh, man, am I glad to see you. I have nothing to say to you, Peter. What? I gave the money back. Why are you still steamed? Peter, you lied to me. You betrayed my trust. Compared to that, welfare fraud doesn't even matter. Really? Well, let's hope the judge feels that way. <sighs> this court will come to order. Well, you know, I figured the sooner I cast a check, the sooner they uh, catch their mistake. <laughs> Look, why are we making a federal case out of this? Mr. Griffin. Don't you think you should have alerted the government of such a gross overpayment? Well, uh, I, I was going to call him, but uh, my, my favorite episode of Different Strokes was on. You know the one where Arnold and Dudley get sexually molested by the guy who owns the bike shop? All right, now I want you boys to scream real loud at my ass. And everybody learns a valuable lesson. Mr. Griffin, have you learned a lesson? Oh, yeah, stay the hell away from that bike shop. <sighs> Look, uh, everybody, I feel really bad about what I did. I, I just... I don't know, I just saw the one chance I'd ever have to give my family the things they deserve. But I guess I screwed it up. I cheated the government, and worst of all, I lied to my wife. And she deserves better. I'm sorry, honey. Mr. Griffin, I think your words have touched us all. I'm sentencing you to 24 months in prison. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, yeah! Excuse me, Your Honor? Yes? Look, uh, my husband may be a bit thoughtless at times. He, he may even be downright, well, stupid, but I know he only accepted that money because he wanted to be a good husband and father. But what he needs to remember is that we love him, and no matter what, I'll always stand by him. I love you too, honey. That was very moving, Mrs. Griffin. Okay, you can go to jail with him. What? 24 months in prison, eh? Unacceptable. Intolerable as it may be, I'm completely dependent upon those wretched drones for sustenance. Let us see how the Iron Constitution of American Justice fares against the device. Is that your boy? What? Uh, oh, uh, yeah, that's Stewie. Gosh, I can't separate a kid that young from his father. It's, it's unjudgmently. Oh, hell, you've learned your lesson, right? Yeah. All right, you're off the hook. Oh, wow, can you give me my job back? No. Yes. All right.